okay so back in the simulator again what about for simple failures well it, it's, it's simple in the sense that it's not affecting the actual flight characteristics of the airplane or the performance or anything like that but it can be critical if you're in icing conditions so I'm going to uh, show you for example a failure of the window heat you know the forward windows are heated they help with uh, bird strike protection as in it strengthens the window somewhat but it also more importantly allows you to see especially in cold weather to avoid the window freezing up which would prevent you having good vision outside so let's simulate the failure for example I'm going to go to ice and rain ice and rain and let's say window overheats for example let's say captain's window overheats the left that's the front one there execute and see what happens there you go so it says here heat window left what does the pilot do the pilot effectively calls up the checklist ice and rain the checklist is on the side anti ice and rain there you go and we're looking for heat window which is what we have there heat window L left so heat window left 3.5 um, there's a checklist heat window left right Condition, the forward window heat is not operating. Objective, to reset the system or remove power to prevent arcing. Choose one, affected window heat is arcing, shattered or cracked. No, it isn't. Affected window is not arcing, shattered or cracked. Yes, go to step two. Window heat switch, left in this case, off for 10 seconds, then on. Reach up here. We look at the window heat. See it there, window heat. The corresponding light is on as well. Off. Let's say 10 seconds is up. 10 seconds on. There it is. And that's reset it. The warning has gone. Continue the checklist. Heat window message stays shown. No, heat window message blanks, go to step four. Choose one, this step four, window fogs. No, window stays clear, continue normal operation. So that's an overheating window reset. So those are simple failures we get sometimes. They don't take long, it takes, sometimes it's just a, a glitch in the system, it gives you an, an indication of overheat, you reset the circuitry and you continue to operate. There we go, later.